Good afternoon, runners. Hope all is well. Just wanted to come and talk today. Oh, first of all, if you notice, I have the, the wired headphones. I read an article this week that this is what all the cool kids are doing. The wired headphones are coming back because the earbuds got, got too, uh, too ubiquitous, and so they weren't cool anymore. Well, I'm happy to say that uh, you stick around with them long enough, it finally comes full circle because I never left the wired headphones. I always had the wired headphones experimenting with the wireless ones always lose them and so it's good to know that i'm finally back to being cool again but what i wanted to talk about was um was gps watches and how sometimes they can cause you a lot of anxiety and how it could be good to turn them off so to give you a little bit of perspective i i've been running long enough that i feel like i ran well before GPS watches existed. And I had the old Timex chronograph and now I have a Garmin GPS watch and I love it and it's great. Um, but one of the bad things about a GPS, there's a, lot, there's a ton of good things, right? We can have a whole talk on that. But one of the bad things about a GPS watch is that you can kind of get a slave to the laps and you judge your performance based upon whatever time it says in a lap split. And if you're tired, if you're in the midst of a tough week, you know, if you're not feeling a little bit good, uh, if you're running a lot of miles, whatever it is, right, you can sometimes look at that lap pace and it can, it can almost, it can almost set your mood, right? It can almost probably put you in a good mood or bad mood and it can cause you a lot more anxiety than it does good. And so, one of the tips that I do when I'm in situations like that is, let's say I'm doing an easy run, and it's good to bring the GPX watch so you know how far you have to run for sure. But one of the things you can do is turn off the, uh, the auto lap feature. Turn it off. And if you do that, your watch won't be giving you lap paces every, every mile. It won't give you lap paces at all um, unless you look at it. And what I have found is just turn it on, let it record, because uh, you want to have your watch. Maybe it's a safety mechanism. Bring your watch, turn off the auto lap feature, and just have your main watch face be the time of the day. Don't even look at your pace and just run, right? Get back to what it was like to run before the technology, before all the data, and, um, you know, just... Uh, just try to enjoy the experience. And an easy run is a great time to do that. You can listen to your breath. You can pay attention to your running form. You can take in the nature, the surroundings, whatever it is, right? But you can get away from just the anxiety that happens every eight to 10 minutes when you're running, when you're running a lap. You can get away from all that. So give that a try. Um, I think you'll find it is a great mental break to not have to have that constant stimulus. It allows you just to get out there, to run, to relax, to um, just to enjoy things sometimes and, and not, have it be, not have it to be work and to be difficult like so many other things that we have in your life. So hopefully that helps. Best wishes chasing your running goals.